Hello everybody and welcome to another edition of Drew's Food Reviews and today I've got another episode of Classic Candy Corner. And I kind of remember these now. I don't know if these are actually from the same company that does Charm Pops and they also have Charm Drops but I found these online at um, Old Time Candy and this is by called Assorted Charms. Uh, it's a little bit like Lifesavers but they're square and um, I think they're like they're hard candy with different flavors. I do remember these. They were like the, the charm pops without the bubble gum in the middle. And not to be confused with, um, they had a, I, I was looking, they had a candy. It was like a, a jelly candy gumdrops. They had one called Chuckles and then they had another one called Charms. And they were like little discs. They were uh, jelly candy with sugar coating. And they were called Charms, but I don't know if they were the same company. But like I said, I found these online. I remember I used to get these, you know, at the drugstore, the gas station, um, sometimes the candy stores. And I remember I used to get them all the time. They were kind of, yeah, like I said, they were like um, some of the other ones, the Lifesavers. Jolly Ranchers, kind of, yeah. All right, I'm trying to nice nicely open this, but oh wow, I didn't I forgot that they were individually wrapped, and not like the lifesavers where they're just all in a roll and all stuck together. Apparently, these are individually wrapped, and I think this one's going to be grape. I think they're all fruit flavors because so this is sorted flavors, and this one is grape. Oh yeah, very hot, very strong grape, grape flavor. I think it was cherry, lemon, grape, orange, lime, and either cherry again or might have been a strawberry. I don't know. I'm not gonna try every flavor in here, but I do remember. It was kind of a little bit like um. Lifesavers also kind of like the the Brock's hard candy. A little individual wrap um, containers. They were like a ball. And then I remember the other ones, they were sugar free. <laughs> they were a little hard candy wrapped up. Those were kind of awful. A lot of times grandma would have those. They didn't want the kids having the sugar. Try to pass them off to the grandkids. Sugar-free candy, sugar-free lollipops too. Um, kind of what it reminds me of lollipop. <laughs> kind of that same flavor. These were like the really cheap um, flat lollipops on a stick. They were in a string, <laughs> but quite a bit of fruit flavor on this one. It does remind me a lot of like the old lollipop you get them from. The barber, the dentist, um, doctor, I guess, afterwards. If you're good, you got a shot. You either got to pick out a toy or got a candy, a light pop or bazooka or something like that. But right along the lines of the lifesavers. And um, then you started getting into the breath mints, the certs, the... Um, the other ones, um, all the other breath mints, stuff, Altoids, things like that. But yeah, this one, kind of remember that one. I wish they'd bring them back. I remember going to this one place that we had that was not too far from me. It was called the Nut Tree. And it had a restaurant and then it had like a little, it was like a, a candy store or like a general store kind of thing they had all kinds of different candies in there hard candies bubble gum um, chocolates all that stuff a lot of them you could do like bulk purchase so you get it by the pound licorice things like that but um, certainly this was one of them on lifesavers of rolls of them Mentos all the old uh, classic rolled candy 
candy bars, boxes of candy, you know, classic Mike and I caught tamales. There was a whole lot of them. And also some of the really old times, like Necco wafers, um, M&Ms, stuff like that. But I remember having these. I think I got them there one time, along with a giant penny that was like a gi um, big giant penny coin. I Somewhere I still have the uh, Grimm's Fairy Tale book that I got when I was, when I was real little. And uh, got it from there. I don't, have the, I don't have the penny anymore, but I think I still have the Grimm's Fairy Tale book. And that was, like I said, this would have been back in, what, the 70s. Uh, that I went there. I just mostly remember lots of different candies. They also had a restaurant you could go there and they had a lot of cool stuff. And um, yeah, but it, and when I went there, they had a little train, you could uh, ride on the train around there. And when I was there, it felt like I was a kid in a candy store because <laughs> literally I was. And uh, they had lots of different candies, um, yeah, jelly bellies, I think. That was when um, Jelly Bellies had first come out, like in the late 70s, early 80s. And the Jelly Belly factory wasn't too far from where that was, so um, that was around the same time. Uh, but certainly I remember the different flavors of hard candy, the Lifesavers, um, Charms, um, hard candy, Jolly Ranchers, yeah, all that stuff. And they were good, nice little rolls, we kept them handy when you wanted something a little bit sweet maybe after dinner and yeah just a little bit of old time memories from some of the hard candy some of the unique candy that I remember from my childhood maybe some of the younger people wouldn't remember all these because they don't really have them in the stores anymore but you never know be always on the lookout for classic candy either in your grocery store or like a specialty market. Sometimes they have them in import store or go on online and look up a uh, you know, classic candy, novelty candy, old fashioned candy. There's a lot of companies out there that specialize in it. And like I said, this was just one of the ones I remember good old charms. Um, like I said, um, kind of fun to go and remember what it tastes like and it brings me right back to when I was a little kid and I had that and a little bit of the memories from it so anyways if you can find them in your store and that was something that you had leave a comment down below and say hey you know hey I remember these get them all the time <laughs> or what your favorite uh, candy was so there you go a little bit of memories from with a little bit of old time charm there you go. So if you liked the video, give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to hit the subscribe and the notification bell over here. That way you won't miss any future content. Or if I go live, you won't miss the fun. So until next time, on Drew's Food Reviews, when I'll be looking at another classic candy for you, maybe something charming, and we'll uh, certainly check it out together. Another episode of Classic Candy Corner. And I hope you're really enjoying the Classic Candy series. I'm still finding a lot of the old ones. And um, when I do, I'll bring them to you. So until next time, guys, talk to you later.